Question number 101. The male and female gametophytes have an independent existence in, as I just discussed in one of the previous questions, that male and female gametophytes, they do not have independent existence in gymnosperms as well as angiosperms. So, ruled out the options which include gymnosperms as well as angiosperms. Option number 1, 2, and 4. So, you are left with the option number 3 which says tidophytes and bryophytes. Yes, tidophytes and bryophytes, they have independent existence of the male and female gametophytes. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 3. Let's move to the next question. Question number 102. The endodermis is impervious to water because of the Casparian strips which are made up of. If you see the endodermis of the roots, not of the stem. So, here we are talking about the endodermis of the roots. So, endodermis of the roots is impervious to water because they have a waxy layer or the waxy coating which is called the Casparian strip and it is made up of the suberin. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 1. Let's move to the next question. Question number 103. In pteridophytes, the main plant body is? First option, thalloid gametophyte. No. You may be remembering about it that in pteridophytes, the main plant body is the sporophyte, which is the dominant plant body. Thalloid sporophyte? No. Thalloid sporophyte means... It is a sporophytic body, but it is not differentiated into root, stem and leaves. But in tadophytes, it is differentiated. Gametophyte, no. Sporophyte, which is differentiated into roots, stem and leaves. It is true. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 4. Let's move to the next question. Question number 104. Identify the plant in the given figure. It is equisetum. So, equisetum has a rhizome, yes, it has branch, nodes, internodes and the strobilus. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 2. Let's move to the next question. Question number 105, read the following statements and you have to tell that which of the above mentioned statements are correct. Pinus has needle shaped leaves, it is true. Cycus is a dioecious plant, it is also true. What is a dioecious plant? When male and female sex organs are present on the separate bodies, this type of condition is called the dioecious condition. So, cycus has dioecious plants. It is true. Salvinia, it is a heterosporous tetophyte. It is also true. Gingo belongs to the order Neetales. No, Neetales is the most advanced order of the gymnosperms, whereas Gingo belongs to the primitive order of the gymnosperms called the Gingoales. So, this is incorrect. So, which of the above are correct? A, B and C. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 3. Let's move to the next question. 